The following demonstration will explore the chemical reactions between baking soda and vinegar. This consists of a soda bottle filled with vinegar and a balloon filled with baking soda. When the baking soda from the balloon is emptied into the bottle of vinegar, the chemical reaction that takes place causes the balloon to inflate. demonstrate the three geometry of a chemical reaction with baking soda and vinegar. First, place six teaspoons of baking soda into the balloon. Next, add 150 milliliters of vinegar to the water bottle. Next, stretch the mouth of the balloon over the mouth of the bottle. Turn the balloon upright with the baking soda inside the balloon before it the vinegar and observe the self-inflating balloon. Yep. The chemical equation for this is as follows. Sodium bicarbonate, or baking soda, reacts with acetic acid and vinegar to form carbon dioxide, water, and acetic acid. Fizzling or presence of bubbles inside the soda pop bottle is the visible presence of carbon dioxide or CO2. If you notice, the bottle is cool to the touch. This is because the reaction is endothermic, meaning that all of the energy in the reaction is used up in the form. The expansion of the balloon is another visible presence of CO2. When the two ingredients are mixed, hydrogen ions from the vinegar mix with the bicarbonate ions from the baking soda to form carbonic acid. Then the carbonic acid immediately decomposes into carbon dioxide gas and water. You just witnessed a demonstration of molecular interactions between baking soda and vinegar. Even though these, this experiment did not seem very difficult, many reactions are taking place, so please feel free to try to